This video will show you how to convert Schlage Primus XP cylinders with classic obverse keyways to the Primus RP design. Topics will include finger pin, key, and plug differences, parts required for converting to Primus RP, cylinder disassembly, finger pin and sidebar installation, and cylinder reassembly. These are the tools and parts you will need. A pinning tray, a plug holder, a Primus RP finger pin, an RP key, an RP plug, pinning tweezers, a plug follower, and a cap removal tool. You should also have a Primus XP finger pin kit on hand. The left side of the screen has a Primus XP pin and on the right side there's a Primus RP pin. The RP pin is copper colored. It has a taller foot than the XP pin and is referred to as a raised pin or RP design. RP finger pins consist of seven different variations and are numbered one through seven. RP pins are not available in a kit and need to be ordered individually based on the side bidding code assigned to you. The key at the top of the screen is a Primus XP key. The key at the bottom is a Primus RP key. The RP key has an extra cutout to allow movement of the taller foot on the RP finger pin. To order RP keys, simply add the suffix letters RP to your existing XP key blank part number. Note, the RP design is only available in classic obverse keyways as shown. The cylinder on the left is Primus XP and the one on the right is Primus RP. Conventional cylinders that will accept the taller foot of the RP finger pin have a small dot on the plug face next to the Primus stamping. This chart illustrates the parts that are required to convert conventional cylinders and full-size interchangeable cores that use classic obverse keyways from Primus XP to Primus RP. You may want to pause the video to study the information on this chart. Both types of cylinders require new RP keys. Both types of cylinders require a new RP finger pin in the third chamber. However, none of the cylinders require a new shell. For example, if you are updating a conventional cylinder that does not have a dot on the plug face, you will need to replace the keys, plug, and the finger pin in the third chamber. For full-size interchangeable cores produced after 2014, the plug does not need to be replaced since it was previously modified and will operate with RP pins. Remember, only cylinders that use classic obverse keyways can be converted from XP to RP. To get started, place the cap removal tool onto the back of the cylinder and unscrew the cap. Remove the cap, tailpiece, cap pin, and spring. Insert an operating key and turn it one quarter of a turn. Place the plug follower onto the back of the plug and start to push the plug out of the shell. As the plug begins to slide out of the shell, place your finger over the sidebar to hold it in position. Place the plug into the plug holder. Remove the bottom and any master pins contained in the plug. Place them onto the pinning tray in the order they were removed. Use the key to turn the plug until the finger pins are visible from the top of the plug holder. Hold your finger over the finger pins and remove the key. Remove the finger pins and place them onto the pinning tray in the order they were removed. Remove the plug from the plug holder and remove the sidebar and sidebar springs. Then remove the finger pin springs. Place an RP plug into the plug holder and then rotate the plug until the finger pin chambers are visible at the top of the plug holder. Insert the five finger pin springs, making sure they drop down completely. Load the finger pins in the first and second pin chambers using the same finger pins used in the XP cylinder. Note, the third pin chamber requires a new RP finger pin. If, for example, your XP cylinder used a number 6 finger pin in the third chamber, the new RP plug would use a number 6 RP finger pin. Reference the chart on the screen for specific finger pin part numbers. Load an RP finger pin in the third chamber. 
Then load the finger pins in the fourth and fifth chambers using the same finger pins used in the XP cylinder. Push the finger pins down and then insert an operating key. Turn the plug until the sidebar cutout is visible. Insert the two sidebar springs into the sidebar cutout. Make sure the springs remain in a vertical position. Position the notches on the sidebar so they face inward toward the plug. Then place the sidebar on top of the springs. Rotate the plug until the pin chambers are visible. Load the bottom pins and master pins, if any, back into the plug. With the key inserted, slide the plug out of the plug holder. Place the plug into the shell. Turn the key and remove it. Place the plug face down and then insert the cap pin spring and cap pin. Insert the cap onto the cap tool and screw the cap in place. Test the key to complete the conversion process. Thank you for watching this video. We trust the information provided will help you successfully convert a Primus XP cylinder to Primus RP. For more information, call Customer Care at 877-671-7011.